We've been developing work in this area for a couple of years really and um, one of our um, tutors from the Open University actually teaches Simone who's the assistant manager here and she suggested she'd be a great person to work with because of her passion for learning and studying with the OU and that she could transfer that to some of the parents and people who use the centre and that's proved to be true because she's um, been a really good advocate for the OU in the community. At the time that we were approached by the Open University I was still a student studying, studying. Um, and I suppose the experiences that I had as a student um, I suppose that's where I identified possible barriers that other parents could have had um, trying to, to manage family life, training and also uh, employment as well. Working with Furswood Children's Centre has been good because it's a hub in the community. It links in with a number of other organisations that work with parents both in this area and in nearby Old Trafford. So we've been able to recruit students that uh, meet our criteria, students who haven't studied higher education before and students who live in um, some of the geographical areas where fewer people tend to go to university traditionally. And those are the kind of people that we want to encourage and support to study with the Open University. I would say the service, the, the project that uh, the Children's Centre have supported the Open University doing, um, one of the main issues was childcare. Um, a lot of the feedback, again, I suppose my own experiences, is finding the time to study, but whilst you've also got young children and having that time, whether it's a couple of hours a week, just to focus on your studying. Um, and I think by our service, we've, we've helped with the childcare, we've helped with the quiet room, um, that's provided parents with that additional opportunity to come somewhere where they know their children are safe, but they've got that time to um, liaise with the tutor, um, but also um, the children are safe and they can just use that time to focus on, on their studies. Um, and I know there's been assistance as well with, with childcare, that our service has been able to signpost parents to um, appropriate childcare whilst they've been training. Students face lots of different kinds of barriers and one of the difficulties is that it's hard to predict what's going to be a problem for someone. But if you look at the big picture, one of the issues is a lot of the students have had negative experiences at school and so they don't really particularly want to carry on as a student. Other people don't have a family background where in their circle people are at university so maybe they just don't think of university as something they should be doing. My experience with studying with the OU, it's been a wonderful experience. It's given me a sense of satisfaction um, and it's made me really want to move on and study high, at a higher level really um, and I hope to carry on really. I studied Understanding Health which was um, a subject that was close to my heart and it gave me more insight into the, um, into the course um, and it's given me more knowledge on that particular subject. It's a boost in confidence, but it's also a very specific thing to do with improving skills. To begin to feel confident about the way you read, the way you make notes, the way you interpret a question. And once those skills are back under control, then people really can manage on their own and they take off, which is great. <laughs> Personally, it's given me satisfaction. It's given me a greed to carry on studying and to gain that degree that I want to gain. One of the very important things about working closely with a partner is that we see students from before they start studying with us right the way through their learning journey studying with the Open University and also what they want to go on and study afterwards and through, stu through supporting students in that intensive way we learn quite a lot about what our students need. Um, we've been doing some follow-up work, one of our tutors Judy has been doing some follow-up work to find out what students experience have been like studying with us and from that we're gaining great insight into how to support students across the university as a whole. So I'd say it's raised the profile for us as a children's centre um, on how we can support parents um, and hopefully this will remain a lot of long term project. For someone to carry on and for someone to come in and study with the OU I'd say give it a shot. It's hard work but with plenty of support, you have plenty of support, tutor support, study groups and if you put your, put your effort into it, you can get far.